Welcome back everyone, Sean Stevens here again with Metroplex Mortgage Services, bringing you another USDA Loan Pro video quick tip. As the saying goes, knowledge is power. In today's video, I will identify key USDA income requirements that you need to know in order to help maximize your qualifying ability. And if you've not yet done so, remember to download our USDA Blueprint for Success with a link below. This free guide is designed to help walk you through the USDA process step by step is a great educational resource for the real estate community. USDA debt to income ratios are calculated in two ways, the housing ratio and your total debt ratios. The housing portion of your debt ratios includes monthly amounts for items such as your principal and interest, taxes, insurance, and other costs such as association fees. This is commonly referred to as your PITI payment. We will take the PITI payment and then divide that by your total monthly gross income used for qualifying, which is also known as your repayment income. Additionally, your total debt ratio consists of that housing expense plus other monthly debt, such as any auto loans, credit cards, and student loan payments, which is then also divided by the monthly gross income. Although some exceptions do exist, USDA published guidelines currently permit 29% of your monthly income to be allowed for a total housing expense. For example, if there is $6,500 in monthly gross income, 29% of that is $1,885. This would be the number that your monthly principal and interest, taxes, insurance, and any association fees would have to equal. However, USDA just announced that USDA debt to income ratios are increasing from 29% all the way up to 34% of your gross monthly income. This is big news for your USDA qualifying loan amount and overall eligibility for a wider variety of homes and sales prices. This increase is expected to be implemented on August 5, 2024. Using the above example, this would automatically be able to increase your monthly payment to $2,210. While this is only a brief summary of USDA debt to income ratios, remember that this new guideline will greatly increase your qualifying budget and allow for more flexibility in the properties you look at. As a USDA-approved lender, we will walk you through the USDA qualifying process step-by-step. Step. Just call, text, or email to discuss your scenario and let us show you the Metroplex difference. Thank you again for forwarding and sharing today's video with any friends, family, coworkers, or clients who are looking to buy, sell, or refinance. As always, I want everyone to make it a great day and look forward to seeing you right here for the next Tip of the Week.